Okay. And some drink. Okay. Mm. Everything will be fine, okay. Thank you so much. God bless you, my daughter. Mm. It's it for me. Mm. Eat. Buy my ice cream. Oh, <laughs> look, ice cream is the least of the things I want to get for you. You know, uh, last week you told me about some Apple laptop. Yeah, a new one is out, and I would like to get that for you. So, you just have to put your mind straight. And then okay. out. Oh, my daughter, just leave and let us go, okay? No, oh, daddy, she needs help. Look. I can see you have a good heart towards such people because this is not the first time you're doing this. Now let me open your eyes a bit. You see this woman, she has a family and it is their responsibility to take care of her and not yours. Simply because if this woman has money, she will take it to the family and not to you. Anywhere you see any poor person in such condition, let them be. Do not feel pity for them. Do you understand me? Let's go home. Let's go. Don't worry yourself. She has a family. Let's go. It is your work, not yours. daughter look today happens to be a holiday and I have done my best to take you out to have fun it is time for me to go back to work now why are you putting up this straight face why are you so stingy on poor people oh, oh. so now I get why you are acting this way Because I stopped you from helping that old woman. Look, your father is not a stingy man. I have to protect my money for you so that when you grow up, you can continue from there. We and those people are not the same. Yes. Look, you don't understand what I am saying. Because of the money I have, I cannot associate myself with those poor people. Look, if that woman happens to be a rich person, I will gladly help her. Yes. But we are all human beings. Now listen carefully to me. I am your father. Anything I say to you, you either listen or understand me. Is that okay? We are not the same. Yes, we are human beings, but we are different people. I don't want to ever see you associate yourself or get close to poor people, okay? I don't like to go hard on you. Don't make me go hard on you. Now, time is not on my side. I'm going inside there to pack up what I'm doing and go back to work. If you are feeling sleepy, go to your room. If you want to eat, go to the kitchen. Don't let me hear you talk about this thing again.
ぱいしてつけよう。Where is she going right now? Let me check the other side. Are you doing <sighs> my daughter mm. i'm not feeling well at all and i'm hungry too i need someone to take me to the hospital if you can be on help for me okay, okay when so i was happy. coming when i was coming i bought some food <sighs> so let me give it to you so that you eat it with the quality thank you okay. and some drink thank okay. you Everything will be fine, okay. Thank you so much. God bless you, my daughter. Yeah, it's it for me. Mm. 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 You'll be fine, okay. Okay. Mm. Thank you so much. God bless you. You are God sent. Amen. Oh. Okay, eat for me. Mm. Hey, little girl. Mm. How are you? I'm fine. Is she your mother? No. Then what are you doing here? Hmm. I was passing by and I saw her. She's very sick. I wanted to help her take her to the hospital, but I don't have money. Oh, so you mean you were passing by, you saw this old woman looking for help, and you want to help take her to the hospital? Yes, please. Oh, that's so nice of you. Um, I'm so happy to see a little girl with such a good heart. Your parent has really inculcated positive things in your head. This is what we, the parents, need to teach our children so that when they grow up, they can understand humanity. See, I wish to see your parents and reward them, but because of what you have done, I want to take this old woman to the hospital. Don't worry, I will take care of all her needs. Okay, no problem. Let me get my driver so that we take her to the hospital. Maze! Maze! Please come over here. Hurry. Um, yeah, please get my car, the Benz, and let's take this old woman to the hospital. Okay, okay madam. hurry up. Okay. okay. Thank you so much. Madam. Don't worry. Everything will be fine. Okay? You need to look good. Such a good girl. What is all this? Yeah, Frank. Look, it's true, okay? My daughter is missing. I have searched for her everywhere, everywhere I cannot find her. I went to the school site, she was not there. Look, I have reported to the to the police and even the TV station you heard the, you heard this news from. Look, I am so confused. I don't have any relative around that I would say she has come to. I have searched everywhere. I don't know what to do. Okay, all right, all right, thank you. Jane, Jane, where have you gone to? <sighs> oh, Jane. 
Where have you been? I've been looking for you everywhere. I went to the old woman. What? You went there? I would have warned you not to go there. Look, I'm sorry for shouting at you. Please forgive me. But it is not safe to be around those people. I am trying to protect you. You are the daughter of a rich man. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever seen a rich kid play with a poor kid? No, it is not there. And that is something I want for you. That is something I want for you. Hey, that is enough for now. Let's go inside. Let me get you something to eat. I'm sure you're tired. Lanedi, please, 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 please. No, I am going to pay you your money. Yes, see, somebody is bringing some money to me. Immediately the money comes, I will deduct your money from it. Please. No, 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 see, don't sack me from the house. I am. Hello? Hello? Daddy, why are you crying? My daughter, I never knew one day I can go so broke within a short period of time. And now the landlady is saying I should leave the house because I cannot pay her rent. So where are we going now? I don't know. I don't know. But you know what? Just wait for me. Let me go pack my other stuff. I promise you, before the sun goes down, we we'll surely get a place to spend the night. And after then, we'll think about where to go, okay? Let's go. So you are still in this house. I thought by the time I would get here, then you are even out. No, no, uh, I'm very sorry. I'm just waiting for my daughter to come so that we leave. Call that your daughter to come out fast. Jane! Daddy, I'm coming! Please hurry up! No, look. We don't even have a place to spend the night. We don't have a place to go. Do I care? I'm sorry. Please leave my house. Wait. Is she your daughter? Yes, she's my daughter. Is this girl really your daughter? This is unbelievable. Excuse me, please. Um, has she done anything wrong to you? No, not at all. Not at all. Greet me. Greet me, sir. Greet me. Wow. You are a real father. I'm, I'm so ashamed to talk to you. What this girl did for an old woman made me realize how you've taught her good things. 
And that is what we parents, we need to do. She was so eager to help this poor old woman. I asked myself, what if this girl becomes a daughter? Just imagine, she's going to be so passionate to do her work, especially attending to the needy people. Look, because of what your daughter did, you people can stay in my house for five good years without any payment. Five years? Yes, five years. <laughs> Hello. Yes. Thank you so much. God bless you. Thank you. Okay, no problem. See, if we teach our children to love one another, this planet is going to be a beautiful place for all of us to stay. You have a very beautiful daughter. It's okay. Right. I'm going inside. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I am deeply sorry for everything I did to you, especially the day you came back from that place. You had a very good intention, but I was against your idea. Now look, see the good thing your idea has brought. She has given us five years to stay in this house for free. Within that five years, I can work, make money, we can even build our own house, just because of the good thing you did. God bless you. I'm really sorry, my daughter. Don't worry, Doctor. 